Hey everyone, it's Loopy Legs Gaming here, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to another video of L.A. Noir. Now, in the last video, Elsa got a settlement for her friend's accident. Cole has his suspicions about the case, and asked Elsa to go and see his friend Jack Kelso. We started a new, a new case called House of Sticks. Elsa went to see Jack, and he agreed to investigate the case. Jack went to see the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. We investigated the house where the Lewis Buckwalter accident happened. It looks like the house was built using repurposed wood from the Keystone Film Company. And we left the video just heading to Keystone Studios. Now, without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. And here we go. The Keystone Film Company. 1.32 p.m. Hi, Mac. I work for California Fire and Life. I'm looking into an industrial accident. Here? No, not here. The housing development over on Normandy Avenue. So? I found some lumber over there had the Keystone name printed on it. We've been closed since 41. Never quite made the transition to talkies. The Suburban Redevelopment Fund are pulling the place down. Know anything about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Nix. Mind if I take a look around? I'm kind of hungry. If someone was to leave a couple of bucks here, I might wander down the street and get a cup of coffee. <laughs> Is there a key to the gate? No. The only guys who go in or out are some delivery guys from Elysian Fields. They're working on a housing development over at Wilton and Santa Monica. You'll have to hop it. Right, so hop the fence. Right. Looking for some lumber. Which one is going to give us the? Hang on. No, no, no vibration here yet. A few moments later. Oh, hang on. Here we go. So this is where their lumber comes from? Hmm. That's shady as fuck, isn't it? Right. Before I go back to the car, there's a room here that we can go into. We can pick up a... I think it's a film or something from the screening room. They are screening room. There we go. Move L and X to select them. All right, we're to refocus it. There you go. And the next one. And the last one to go forward. That should be it. In a great day for the future of Los Angeles, civic leaders and businessmen join forces to launch the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Mm. The Suburban Redevelopment Fund pledges to speed up housing development for returning GI. Gentlemen, this is Dr. Harlan Fontaine. He's our latest investor in the Suburban Redevelopment Fund. Doctor, this is Curtis Benson. He's vice president of the California Fire and Life. Pleased to meet you, Doctor. Ray Gordon, editor of the Times. Doctor. District Attorney Don Sandler and Police Chief Warren. Gentlemen, I am delighted to be in such exalted company. You're making quite a name for yourself, Doctor, amongst the thespian fraternity. I find that those of artistic temperament are often of a fragile mental disposition. It's a short step from miscreant to recidivism, Doctor. Very true. But I think we could all agree that the City of Angels does rather well basking in the reflection of the motion picture industry. Hear, hear. 
And it's something that every sucker getting off a train at Union Station wants a part of. Gentlemen, we're here to sell the American dream, and Hollywood is our greatest advertiser. So, how is your new development selling, Leland? Cannot throw them up fast enough, Ray. And that's part of the problem, Leland. Mm. Washington is receiving steady complaints. There's a clamor for public housing. God damn it, Ray. Public housing is tantamount to communism. Now, that's why we fought this goddamn war. I'm telling you, it's reds by the back door. You can't have it both ways, Leland. The new freeways are being built to service all your developments out in the boondocks. They're all being built with government money. The GI Bill is government money. There's a difference. What difference? The GI money ends up in my pocket. I hope you mean uh, our pockets, Leland. We're all investors. Of course, Curtis. Mm. So, when will the freeway bond be passed on? It still has to be ratified. It takes a long time to raise $3 billion. I need to find a game well or a telephone. In a great day for the future of Black Panther. So, get a telephone in the three office bit here. Operator, think you could put me through to police dispatch? Thanks. This is Jack Kelso, investigator for California Fire and Life. Can you put me through to Curtis Benson, please? Just a moment, please, Mr. Kelso. Jack, how can I help? Do you know anything about the Suburban Redevelopment Fund, Mr. Benson? I've heard of them, Jack. Building new homes for GIs. With green lumber that was used on movie sets. Jack, are you working the Buck Walter case? Mr. Benson? Are you part of the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Jack, I want you to listen very clearly. Call Miss Lickman. Call her as soon as you hang up. Arrange to see her tonight and get her to agree to the settlement. Do it tonight. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. End of story, Jack. I don't want to hear another word about Elsa Lickman or Luke Buckwalter. Can you put me through to Michigan 221? Putting the call through. Hello? Ms. Lichtman, it's Jack Kelso. Yes, Mr. Kelso. I've been looking into your case. Yes, and what have you found? It doesn't look good. I need to see you. Meet me at the Blue Room. I work there tonight. I take a break around nine. I'll be waiting at the stage door. We can talk then. Auf Wiedersehen, Mr. Kelso. Auf Wiedersehen. The Blue Room, 9.04 p.m. And don't suppose I make a plea Cause baby, you know I'm guilty He just walked in, waved, and then walked out. What were you doing with him? I was doing what you asked. I didn't ask you to meet him in an alleyway. Why do you snarl at me? Your friend came to ask me to accept the insurance. He's plan. not my friend, Elsa. I think he's a brave man, and you have placed him in great danger. You've involved him in something, and he has no idea of the risk. Can you live with that, Cole? Elsa, I need his help. He hates my guts. Forget the past, Cole. He deserves a chance to say no. If he helps you, 
Let it be on his terms. I'll go see him in the morning. Right, so investigate uh, Elysian Fields Site 2. Oh, I took away my fast car. Damn it. Elysian Fields Site 2. I was liking that fast car too. Right, guys, we'll see you there. Elysian Fields Site, 9.20 p.m. Right, let's jump in this house. That's where it's pointing us to. Oh, something went there. Right. I think there was a switch. Is it down here? Yeah. Flick that switch. Nice wiring job, fellas. Keep them in the dark. Hmm. Now, where is the kitchen? In here, try the taps. Oh. Good thing I'm not thirsty. <laughs> Alright, now let's go upstairs. something Mac oh I thought these private eye types were all wise guys with smart mouths looks like the snappy repartee has all dried up get on with it what's your hurry Mac you got some place to go you ever do the cat and mouse routine without a gun in your hand now that's more like it oof let's put a few guys in that side. oh time for you to lose your teeth I'm about to break your goddamn jaw. Finish him off. Oh. Too many for us to take. Ah. Oh. You're a worn tough guy. You should learn to take a hint. Get him downstairs and into the trunk. Oh, shit. Sure, he turned up all right. He's wishing he didn't. He's in the trunk. He's going nowhere. The boys introduced themselves. <laughs> what do you want done with him, Mr. Monroe? <sighs> Mr. Yeah, Monroe. I know a good place. Pick up a shovel and a pick on the way. It's up in the hills behind Griffith Park. We'll deal with that German bitch next. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, oh, oh. Jack managed to escape. Oh shit. Elsa. Get in a vehicle. What the hell? Sorry, pal. Desperate times. Whoa. Monroe owns the city. Owns the cops. I need to find Elsa. Oh no, they're right on our tail. Must be his blind spot. Managed to lose them for the time being. Ah, oh, shit, here they come again. Damn it. Watch it. Please, damn it. Stupid bitch running across the road. Where are they? Is that the last of them? Come on, car. <laughs> it's like the car was like gonna go slow there. He'll clean himself up a bit. That army forty five, Cole. Oh, <laughs> for God's sake, Cole, call an ambulance. Oh, we missed a few clues there. Damn it. Oh, a lot of vehicle damage and a lot of city damaged. Only got a four star. Damn it. Well, so that's House of Six done. It says, The truth uh, is out on Elysium Fields, despite Leland Monroe's best efforts to bury it. Damn it, I can't believe I missed a few clues. Oh well. Right, let's go over the next one. Oh. Satchel charges on the cave entrance from above. Covering fire on weapons team. Look for snipers in the trees. You know the drill. No risks, no heroes, no prisoners. You want some roast on this one, Sarge? No, you guys have done enough. Head back to Webs. We are going to blow every cave we come across. Close them down and move on, people. Damn. I was hoping to get me a samurai sword. Skipper says that Phelps has fallen behind again. He's got his fire team's checking every cave. He's lost another flamethrower. He wants you to get over there and hurry them along. Oh, boom. 
Weapons Compass. Sir. Sir. We have a major cave complex in front of us, Hogaboom. I want flamethrowers and BAR teams to clean it out. Begging your pardon, sir. But if it's a big complex, why don't we bring the Shermans in? They could pour it in there. We can't wait for tanks to be brought up. I'm already behind. Then blow the cave. No skin off our nose. Bury them We in are it. going in there and clearing them out. We are doing it by the numbers, Sergeant. Get your team in place. We're moving out. Mount up! First fire team and flamethrowers, head in! Leading them into an ambush. Where's he going? Where's who going? The big cowboy. He's going in. Who gave that order? You did. Hmm. Oh, a polite invitation. Sorry if you see uh, the shine on my head. <laughs> it's a bit warm in this room. It's been about 24 degrees the day. Oh, crazy. Oh. Looking a bit worse for wear. Hello, Miss Lichtman. How long have you been sitting there? Not long, Mr. Kelso. You look lovely, Princess. You haven't exactly caught me at my best. It's okay, Miss Lichtman. I'm a big boy. I know how to take my licks. Please, call me Elsa. Okay, Elsa. What can I do for you? I'd like to explain because I... I can join the dots, Elsa. Cole needs your help, Jack. The police department have frozen him out. Look, you're obviously a brave lady, but you can't fight all Cole's battles for him. I just wanted to apologize you for... You don't have to apologize. You were right about Elysian Fields. Tell me something. What was Lou Buckwalter's regular job? He was a carpenter. He built sets for Arkeo, Warner Brothers. Set carpenter? Perfect. If you don't mind, Elsa, I'd like to get a little rest now. I've got a lot more dots to join, and it's making my head hurt. That's perfectly understandable, Mr. Jack. I hope we can meet again under less dramatic circumstances. So too, Princess. I'd like that. Are you Kelso? Who's asking? Peterson, Assistant DA. You're in the wrong building, Peterson. This is a hospital. <laughs> a wise guy. Let me tell you a story, Kelso. Can I get the abridged version? My head hurts. You're a funny guy, Jack. What do you want, Peterson? A colorful character mentioned your name. He said that you might know something about... There's a problem with colorful characters, Peterson. First they send you over a drink, then they buy you dinner, then you get a phone call in the middle of the night for a favor. Try rubbing shoulders with some solid citizens. They're the ones you're supposed to protect. You finished, Kelso? For the moment. I'm gonna run for DA, Kelso. The current administration stinks. And you want me to help? I'm looking for a DA's investigator. You get a gun and a badge and $120 a month. I get $150 a month now. I'm going after the vice squad, Kelso. It's going to get me elected. Mm -hmm. Something better. How about Leland Monroe? The property developer? You think I fell down the stairs? So we're going to be a DA investigator. Right, so pay Curtis Benson a visit. Right. Thanks for the patch up, Princess. It might be the only R&R &R I get for some time. He seems to like to call women princess, doesn't he? 
Right guys, I think that's where I'm going to leave the video. Remember, if you want to help support the channel, please check out the links in the description. And thanks for watching another video of Ellie Noir. If you've liked it, high five that like button. And if you want to see more, be sure to smash that subscription button down below. And last but not least, remember life's a game. So play it well. I'll see you in my next video.